Hi, I'm Owen. I'm a SparkFun engineer, and today we're going to be talking about the SparkFun Edge Board and the Apollo 3 Arduino Core. I'm going to show you how you can run the Blink example on the board and how you can become a developer for the core. To get started running the Blink example on the Edge Board, the first thing you'll need to do is install the Arduino Core for the Apollo 3, and that can be done following the instructions in the GitHub repo, the link for which is in the description. Now, once that core is installed, you'll be able to go to your examples in the basics folder and click on Blink. And that comes up right here, like this. So then for the edge board, the core doesn't yet have an LED built in. So you need to choose the LED that you want to blink. And they're listed on the left-hand edge of the edge board. And the numbers that you could choose are 46, 37, 44 or 47. I'm going to choose to blink number 44. And so that means I need to change the LED to 44 here, here, and here. With that done, just go over to the tools and select the port that your board is connected to, in which case, or in my case, it is COM4. And the board with the core installed will show up as SparkFun Edge underneath SparkFun Apollo 3. So click on that, and then you can check out the upload and compilation process by doing this. Make sure that you hold the button 14 while it's uploading, and that way your board will be able to be programmed automatically by the Arduino IDE. So once you've finished uploading your code and you see the done uploading message, just hit the reset button to start blinking the LED. Now that you've seen how you can blink the LED on the edge board, you're probably wondering how you can do more. If you want to help develop the Arduino core, visit the core repo on GitHub. The link is in the description. And then download it, install it, and try it out. The way that you can do that is by following the instructions and information on the page here. You'll find the contents of the repository, the status of development, how to install the board, and then instructions for how to contribute. When you've tried out the core and you find, for example, that analog write doesn't work, then let us know in an issue. Or if you have the ability to write code that will make it work, let us know and submit a pull request. That way, you can become a developer and help make this core the best that it can be. All right, so that's how you use the Apollo 3 Arduino core with the SparkFun Edge board. We really look forward to you trying it out and contributing. Thanks.